All right, bug catcher Rick. You take your Caterpie, um, we'll get it electrocuted by my super fierce Pikachu. I need to stop faffing about. I want my Meltan. Ha ha ha. Also, my Pikachu is like five levels higher. Switch! Switch exclusive game. No, Caterpie can't hack it. Your Caterpie is weak. Ooh, Metapod. I'll get that Caterpie first. I'll get the fat Metapod. There was news about another Pokemon Switch game. Yes, they said that there will be um, another mainline game next year, I think. Like a completely new one, whereas this is basically... a uh, Pokemon Yellow remake? With Go features? And obviously nice graphics. Maybe shaking counts as why? Back for a while. Agario! <laughs> My god, they have events? You can transfer all your Go Pokemons, not the ones with hats, and only the Kanto ones, so no Gen 2 onwards. So if the Pokemon in your balls. No, Luffy. No. Cry, Caterpie, cry. Fat Metapod. No, I missed the Fat Metapod! I see a Pikachu! Pikachu! Come on, Pika. Stare my ball. Hey! My ball said Pikachu. Put him in my ball sack. First throw. <laughs> At least it doesn't prompt you to rename your Pokemon as soon as you catch them as well. Pika Butt is a girl little idea on what's happening. Me neither. I'm walking around, catching wild Pokemon, and that is it. I don't know why. I mean, aside from you gotta catch them all. Which mechanic specifically? You don't like the throwing. I really not like not having to do random battles. I've said it many times tonight, today. But God, I hate them so much. I like being able to run away from stuff I'm not fighting. As in, like, in-game run away. I'm not even fighting. I like being able to avoid Pokemon I don't want. That's the one. He's a big one. Oh, you don't farm Pokeballs in this game. You farm them and go. Hello. Hey, do you know if Bulbasaur appeared in this forest? I've not seen any. She threw sausages instead. Alright, last Brittany. Nidoran is a normal type. And I definitely know what those are weak to. Fighting, apparently. Which I have no fighting pokes, so you're gonna get thundered!
By bonding, do you mean stuff like Pokemon on me, or do you just mean battling? I don't know if the other games had Pokemon on me. Uh, no, Caterpie, don't care. Trainer tip, shake your Joy-Con when it's not attached to your system. You can play with your partner. Yeah, but I don't want to. Yo, you can't punk out on battle if you're a real Pokemon trainer. That's okay, I'm a pick, uh, kick your butt. Loving it up making your own kind of bonding. That's just fighting. Fighting grind. They always look sad. They do, right? Their little faces. <gasps> what? I didn't one-shot it. What is this outrage? Snorlax, nice. I haven't seen Snorlax yet, but I also haven't moved very far. Why does he have on clothes? Because he's adorable! I need to get to the clothes part. I got given these by my friend's sister or something. Need must get more clothes for Pikachu. Oh, Caterpie is evolving! I like the spacey background. My first evolution. It's a nice animation, I like it. A large impact may cause it to pop out of its shell. Metapod learned Harden. I don't know what I'm looking at here. We've got height and weight here. Is that this one's height and weight? Because if so, then what are the records on the right? I don't remember getting those. Yeah, I don't know if you if you do with the actual in-game battles. Sorry, I don't know if you do within the Pokemon family, but I know like Onyx will tower over you. And things like that. Apparently the sizes do scale in Pokemon Go, but like everything's so oversized and weird, you don't really notice. Or at least I've never noticed. Double team! Maybe? Let's try not to accidentally back out of it this time. Pika Pika! By moving rapidly, the user makes illusory copies of itself to raise its evasiveness. Nah. I just like filling Pikachu with zappy attacks. On the other hand, I never use Growl, so I might as well just do that. One, two, and ta-da! Pikachu forgot Growl! And Pika Butt learned double team. Pidgey wants to learn quick attack. Yeah, why not? What do you have? Tackle. Which is 40 and 100. Or quick attack, which is also 40 and 100, but always first. Oh, 
know. Do I know the trick for throwing a Pokeball well? It's fighting! <laughs> you are challenged by Last Jocelyn. like the animations. I get so little money. Probably because I've been walking around gaining too many levels. Also, I don't want to walk around this dude anymore. Let's have my Mew follow me. Piddles. Oh, I can change its name loads. So I don't actually have to keep it as Pika Butt. Hey, little cute Pokemon. How you doing? Pika Butt looks surprised at how bright the sun is. Okay, Pikachu. Wanna scratch your hat? He likes being poked. <laughs> I can poke his ear. <laughs> I'm way too amused by this. Stop moving. Poke. Can I poke anything else? I can poke him in the butt. Okay! Ooh. Anyway. Hi, Mew! So floaty. Now a caterpie's be gone. Trader tips. Visit Professor Oak to have him check out your progress. Now nah, I'm good. Go away, Pidgey. Wait up! What's the hurry? Why the rush? Where's the kid who likes shorts because they're comfy and easy to wear? Give, you're good at this. <gasps> How dare you beat me? Well, all my Pokemon are like 10 levels higher than yours. Leaving Viridian Forest. Hello. Have you noticed the skinny trees on the roadside? They can be chopped down with a secret technique called Chop Down. How do I get it? How do I join the Secret Technique Society? Higher CP is, the higher its combat power is. I hear CP is a value made of various stats and things combined. I forgot about CP. Has it been showing CP and I haven't noticed? Many Pokemon live only in forests and caves. You need to be persistent and look everywhere to get different species. Hey, nice! I was hoping we'd run into you, into each other. Okay, Buzz. You know there's a Pokemon gym up this way, right, Weaves? You can battle against the gym leader there, and he's seriously strong. 
If you want to get stronger, you've definitely got to try and take him on. Ah, <laughs> jeez, Pika Butt. You're ready for a good battle too, huh? Who wouldn't be? Alright then, you're making me want to cheer you guys on too, so take these. Ooh, potions. Thanks, Buzz. I bought some for you at the prize money I've been earning in all my battles. Oh, okay, he's not so bad then. Beat that gym leader weeps and you can really call yourself a true trainer. Have you beaten the gym leader yet? Pika. Chancy. Rest, please. Yeah, they're quite frowny as well. Also, he's evil. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Pokemon Center News! Yes! Please be careful of a group of people calling themselves Team Rocket. They have been known to steal people's Pokemon and use Pokemon for evil deeds. Please stay away from anyone who has a big R on their clothing. It's discrimination! To our readers who are strong trainers, please do not respond to any attempts they might make to recruit you. Nobody else should ever wear an R on their t-shirt. Pewter City Specialty Pewter Crunchies! They're 500! You're limited to one package per day, though. I don't know what they are, but I'll take them. I will give $500 to the random guy in the Pokemon Center. They're very hard, so be careful. Medicine. Okay, so moving the thing is why. Well, that's good to know. It can be used to heal all status conditions. Oh, cool. No! Oh my god. Quit. Back, back, back. Okay. I know how to use the controller. I really want a Pikachu, so I'm trading my Clefairy for one. I have a Pikachu! Ah, oh, she's got a Switch! She's not a real Pikachu trainer. I'm trading Pokemon with the girl next to me. I had two Pikachus, so I figured I might as well trade one. I'm very easily amused by consoles and games, especially with Nintendo. A Wii in Animal Crossing? Best ever! The Pewter City Gym Leader Brock is a Rock-type Pokemon user. Well, that's not good for Pikachu. Rock-type Pokemon are weak to grass and water-type moves. If you don't pay attention to type matchups, you can't defeat the Gym Leader. Better train that Oddish. What? Team Rocket is at Mount Moon? Huh? I'm on the phone, scram! Where's Mount Moon? It's the next area! What's this? Diglett's Cave. Well, that's not much use for me for a Brock. Psst! Do you know what I'm doing? No. I'm spraying lure around to get wild Pokemon to come visit my flower beds. Okay. Psst! Do you know what I'm doing? No. I'm spraying Repel around to keep wild Pokemon out of my flower beds. Okay, weirdos. Peter City, a stone grey city. Yes, be godish. That's huge. Pro trainer right here. All right. Yes, look at that, a hundred points. That'll do. That Pidgey would be an option. If I can't find any Oddish. What was that? Pikachu! 
No, go away, Caterpie. Yes, I'm always gonna go for Pikachu. Boy, Pikachu! I don't know if there's breeding in this. I presume so. Wait, no. Because that didn't come till later, did it? I don't know if it's in it or not. I read something about it and probably forgot. Ow. Yes. Oh, it's seven o'clock already. Mm. Well, Nick's gone out for a run, so there's no real rush for me to quit yet. But I gotta stop at half seven, I gotta eat, then we gotta go look for Pokemons, because I haven't done my quest today and I wanna get my Sinnoh Stone. And then I probably need to edit this and figure out how YouTube works. Pikachu! Do I get more for catching Metapod? Let's find out. Yeah, Nick likes running. These healthy people. You're leaving early to go home. Good plan! It is Friday! Oh, look at that! Come on, Metapod, stay in. Yes. These growls. Okay, bonus multiplier 3.3 got me 40 points. Bum, 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 bum. <gasps> fat Kakuna! No, come back! Okay, Fat Metapod. Wait, I saw Butterfree. Ooh, that's not gonna still be there, is it? No, it's not. Like, it's not warm. But... I was out fighting gyms in just sweatpants the other day. Not just sweatpants, I had a top on and a hoodie. But, you know, I wasn't wearing thermals. Or a jacket. I was cold. But I was definitely out for like 20 minutes, which normally I wouldn't be at all. I like dodging stuff. It makes running around more active. In game, obviously, not running. But you do actually have to pay attention instead of just blindly like, okay, walk forwards, fall asleep. Go away, Pidgey. Hello. Did you check out the museum already? I did not. Really? You absolutely have to go. Hey, Graveler. Dude. Okay, Geodude. Why do I always call them Gravelers? I know they're Geodudes. Ah, it's so refreshing. Pewter City stays lovely and cool since it lies at the base of the mountain. Where's a gym? Oh. What you doing, Mew? Mew found something in the plants. You got a Nana Berry. Thanks, Mew. This is my sweet little Frey. When she walks with me, she sometimes finds items in the field. Yes. What this? Pewter Museum of Science. Oh dear, what am I supposed to do with you, Slowpoke? Oh, hello there. Do you think you could do me a favor? Sure, why not? I want to go to the Pewter Museum, but my dear Slowpoke here is just refusing to budge. Kick him in the butt. Poke. Do you think you could keep an eye on my dear Slowpoke for a little while? Sure. Oh, thank you very much. He better not run away. In that case, please keep my dear Slowpoke company for a little while. Okay. Guess I'm just staring at a Slowpoke now. Pikachu seems interested. Slowpoke is staring blankly ahead. You spent a relaxing time with Slowpoke. Oh. Burr. Thank you for keeping an eye on dear Slowpoke. Here, this is for your trouble. 
You got a big pearl. Ooh. Yeah, maybe I'll babysit. I'll be your slow poke sitter. Is this the gym? Peter City Pokemon Gym. Gym leader Brock, the rock solid Pokemon trainer. Do I need a tagline? Guys, what's my tagline? This is a very small gym. Hiya! You're here to challenge the gym, aren't you? I'm not a trainer, but I can tell if you're worthy of challenging the gym leader. Now, let's get started! The Pewter City Gym only allows trainers who know type matchups to enter. I have a handy cheat sheet. There are a few types that have an advantage against the gym leader's rock type Pokemon. But for trainers who've never challenged a gym before, we have them use either grass or water type Pokemon. You have to show me a grass or water type if you want to face the gym leader. Here's one. Great! That Pokemon is exactly what I wanted to see! Head on in and aim to become a Pokemon champion! Yes, yeah, so you can't actually fight them unless you have one, but then I presume you can use whatever you want. Thank goodness you don't have a person great and quizzy with the ghost go gyms. Oh my god, right? Might actually learn stuff though. Certified trainers, Buzz. Oh, Buzz has already been here. Trainers here are a bit different from those you've faced so far. Oh, do they actually know what they're doing? Picnicker Amara. Go, Oddish! I'ma grass you in the face! So why isn't always useful? Sorry, shaking isn't always why. Hmm. Absorb! Goodbye, Geodude! Kicks butt. Poison powder. I wanted grass moves. Never mind. We have one grass move. <gasps> You're quite different from the challenges I faced. I'm amazing. That's why. Such anguish. Stop right there, kid. You're 10,000 light years from facing Brock. No. I'm gonna kick your butt and then kick his too. Camper Liam. Camper Liam sent out Geodude. Again. so surprised. <gasps> Light years is in time. It measures distance. Oh, I made a science mistake. How awkward. That's right, Liam. Hey, Brock. How you doing? Gonna cook me a nice meal? Make me some sandwiches? So you're here. I'm Brock, Pewter City's gym leader. You can see just by looking at my Pokemon how rock hard my willpower is. My Pokemon are all hard as rock and have true grit determination. Oh no. That's right, my Pokemon are all rock types. Fwahaha! <laughs> You're going to challenge me even though, even knowing that you'll lose. That's what a trainer's honor demands. So be it. Show me your best. Prepare to get your butt kicked. <laughs> I 
Maybe he knows that he's the level one gym leader. Obviously not level one, but he's the low level gym leader. And therefore he has to put on a show for all the new kids. Oh, level 11. Ah, still one shot, yeah. So small. Still gonna suck the life out of ya. Good thing I did do all that grinding. <laughs> it's super effective. I do like the size difference thing. It looks good. You beat Gym Leader Brock! Oh, he's not even sad! He is just being like, ha ha ha, kids! You're going to get kicked! Seems I underestimated you. You got 1920 for winning! As proof of your victory, take an official Pokemon League badge! A Boulder badge! Thanks, Brock! Why is Pikachu so cute? With a boulder badge, Pokemon up to level 20 from other trainers will listen to you. Without question. Oh, and wait! Take this with you, too. You got a headbutt from Brock. If you use a TM or technical machine, you can teach your Pokemon the move within it. A TM can be used as many times as you like, so use it on any Pokemon you want. Okay, cool. Deals damage to your opponent's Pokémon by ramming them with a head as hard as rock. Okay, whatever that is down there is super cute. Why do you want me to shake my thing? No, go away. Why is Pikachu playing with a controller? I don't know. I managed the city with the park. No. It's... Apparently like 10 hours in and I've been going super slowly. Gym Leader Brock, Certified Trainers, Buzz and Weaves, yes! Come on, you can transfer a Pokemon from Pokemon Go into the safari park, Aaron. And then you have to go and catch them in the safari park and then you can adventure with them. So that's how I will get. So for Eevee, for Let's Go Eevee, basically the Pokemon that won't be in my game are Ekans, Arbok, Vulpix, Ninetales, Meowth, Persian, Bellsprout and its evolutions, and Coughing and Pinsir. So I gotta transfer them over. I gotta, that's what I need to hunt today actually and over the weekend. Get me some extras. And the ones exclusive to Pikachu are Sentru, Oddish, Mankey, Growlithe, Grimer, and Scyther. Is there trading? I presume so. I mean, there were... I realize it was in the game, but there were two characters trading with switches in a room in the previous town. Don't tell me. You've got to be Weaves, right? Is that Brock's old, uh, Buzz's older brother? I am! That's amazing! Just like me. Ha! Huh, I knew it! I'm always right. I'm blue. I heard from my gramps that two new kids set out from Palatown to become trainers. Just like I did once. So I came to check you out. I was thinking you might some advice on how to beat the gym from an expert trainer like me, but looks like I showed up too late, huh? Seems you're not too shabby yourself. So I guess you've earned a reward, newbie. You got five great balls from blue. Oh, that's nice. Those will be even better for catching Pokemon than plain old Pokeballs. 
And hey, that thing you've got there? That's a Pokedex, right? Alright, uh, that's a Pokedex, right? So Gramps finally went and made one. He used to make me just scribble on a map with a pencil about where I encountered Pokemon. You'd better do a good job helping him out. He may be Professor Oak to you. And sure, he's an old coot, but he's still my Gramps. Is this Gary's kid? Smell you later, newbie. Okay, Blue. 